ninja warrior over here. <laughs> Obstacle course. That's like literally in the ninja warrior course. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Thomas and Beth back again with Moto Photo, and we are here with the next episode of season two, episode three of The Witcher. Uh, and the title is What is Lost? And uh, I can tell you what is lost from the last episode. Everything. Is uh, common sense. Yeah, yeah. Common sense Your among sense of knowing. Among among the witchers. Oh, well, yeah, and the fact that uh, It was confusing. You know, it in typical Witcher fashion, it, it it's so confusing. Episode to episode just leaves you with a bunch of question marks and you're like wait a minute what is what happened i don't fully understand what i just saw um you know uh, uh most specifically speaking with yennefer uh and the whole elf thing and that that whole that whole scene was extremely confusing i'm sure uh i'm sure it you know and maybe on a rewatch it might make more sense but uh definitely on a first watch it was uh rather confusing and I think it's going to take a few more episodes to make sense. I don't think rewatching is going to help me. Yeah, I mean, there were three visions that happened. There were three different, very different visions, very different takes on what I, seemed to be the same. And what's the witch power of that? Woman. What's the power of that elf? What is what is her purpose? You know, I, I I'm very confused as to what she even is. Yeah, you it, know, why did why was there one elf and two? What are what is she a magician? Which mages? Yeah, mages. Yeah. Th so why were mages put into this elven? I, yeah. Bleh. Yeah. Well, and not to mention, I mean, the whole elf clan that they had, you know, was uh, very surprising because uh, there aren't really supposed to be apparently that many elves alive still. But and there hasn't been one born in quite some time they said yeah one full-blooded elf um born and born in some time yeah so that's that's an interesting take and so uh, i'm glad that they're introducing that new well not n a new race in the uh in the thing because there there was elves in season one but uh definitely uh in full force in this season so uh, i'm curious to see how they get used and utilized uh throughout the storyline but uh as far as uh siri and Geralt, um uh, we saw them at um at the weird house name, uh, the, the, the Mora, Mora, can't, Kurt, Kurt, Mora, whatever, whatever the castle's name was, but, uh, the place uh, where it happened. They got, they got taken over by, uh, the, the tree guy who was infected and, uh, all ended well and ended with, uh, you know, Geralt kind of finally, I guess, deciding to, you know, teach Siri how to fend for herself because, uh, you know, I think she's It's gonna, a scary world. I think she's going to need to know how to, but I think uh, it's going to soon realize that she may not need a sword and anything at all because she probably has more power than any of those witchers in there. So I'm curious to see, uh, see that. So how this unfolds and her training unfolds. So... Let's do it. So here is episode three of The Witcher. And if you guys haven't already, feel free to like and subscribe to the channel so you can get all the Witcher action going on throughout these next couple weeks. So until then, here is episode three. Oh, there she is. You have to wonder how much she, time has passed. Is she training? Looks like she's taking it seriously, though. That's good. I guess he's not turning into a tree. Yeah. Still is it for lunch? She blew him all real quick. Well, at least he knows that she sees things, but he doesn't know she can scream like a banshee. Like a banshee. What did you call a witcher with no brains? Lamba. <laughs> <laughs> She's settling in right in. He made his choice. Cost us a brother. That wasn't our brother. Not by the end of it. And bitterness won't help us find what killed him. Oh, I know what killed him. Oh, he, because he killed him, technically. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The old man said he was in the right, too. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't him anymore. I mean, no, and he's studying him. Gross. No gloves. No such thing. Is that it's back Jennifer's? Back Mage Temple, yeah. Us, man. I need a rewatch. I didn't think Jennifer meant that much to her. But didn't she, Jennifer, remind her of herself? Yeah. We'll be burying a lot more than 14 mages then. 13. Hmm. Oh, she's happy she to see that. Popped in. 
Just let me pop in real quick. What's going on, everybody? I guess that's Jennifer's symbol, maybe. When you were at Sodom. You did what you had to do. And I, for one, will always be grateful for your sacrifice. It's her sacrifice that she has no magic anymore? Uh, I don't know. They can't give it back to her? Uh, Go through the ritual again? Is that what you want? I want to do what a witcher does. You messed up her bag, man. Way to go. You're the real hero now. What is it? An obstacle course? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess so. Till she get... She'll do it, too. Go! Oh! Off to a good start. I thought she would get it the first time. Are you gonna eat the wood wood body? Dogs like sticks. <laughs> the only certainty on this continent, my boy, is that no one is ever what they see. Like you. Hmm. He has other plans. Oh, you almost made it past three. Oh, just two. Oh, just two. Geralt's gonna be pissed. How's he gonna know? He's not gonna see the bruises on her. Her face is still pretty. Can't you just jump on one and ride it? That, the sword thing? Oh, those are... That doesn't seem very... Friendly. <laughs> that cutter. I saw blood. I saw blood. Where are you going? Oh, is that prisoner still alive? How's he still alive? Well, she told him he would be. Her hands went into his brain. Oh, no. Damn. He didn't see everything. Dude, she's like gonna beat it. Come on. Get up. That's a long way down. Her arm is pretty hurt, too. Ninja warrior over here. <laughs> Obstacle course. That's like literally in the ninja warrior course. <laughs> Great dismount. It counts. <laughs> She would fall in the water, Ninja Warrior. So close. <laughs> I've known many who wanted to be great fighters in my time. They're all dead. Do you know where they are now? I predict the future. In cemeteries. I'm like a seer. Should basically be in the show. She's a teenage girl, man. You can't... Oh, poor guy. What the hell is that? That's her... Sigil. Isn't that what it's called? Why was it in there, though? I thought she just hit it. I'm not too suspicious of it, but he is. Down. That's why you're losing your balance. Your enemies aren't on the ground. Again. Is everybody training I love her? how every, yeah. I love it. She's getting the best of like every, every person's strength. I, it is. I told you it was the tree. It's Eskel Slashy. Look at that thing. Holy crap. What in the hell is that? That looks like something way worse. Just a little bit. Oh, shit. It's like a scorpion mantis. It's going after her. Holy crap. She runs so slow. She's tired, man. She's been training, man. Just leave her alone. 
excuses. It's above you. Can't she just scream and kill it? She just might. Just wait. And then, what's his face? Gerard. Geralt's gonna see it. Man, it's like a centipede, man. It's disgusting. Thing is crazy looking. What is it doing? Nice move. Look at that head. Easy. Light work. What about the tree? That thing didn't have fire through its heart. Yeah, it got ripped apart. Yeah, but that doesn't kill it. It's not it's only fire through the heart, they said. The sacrificial doom. I don't like that guy in the red. Yeah, he's, he's a baby back bitch. He's evil. He has other intentions. He's scared of her. That's what it really is. He's gonna get away. And she's just being a brat just to be a brat. Look at her, she's laughing about it almost. Why Come on. Don't yourself. What do you say? Oh. I'm saving me. <laughs> I don't care about you. I'm just getting out of here. Cool. Cool. We finally got some, some real depth on Yennefer. So no uh, no powers, but... uh. Sounds like she can get him back, according to the red crazy-haired witch. Uh, yeah, the, 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 the red-hooded witch, or the crazy witch, yeah. There's so much, like, left with open-ended with what she can do or what she's going to do or i don't think she's going to join that whole that whole cult i don't that's not her style but uh no she's more of a freelance i think she's just going to try and find her magic i think that's her whole mission now is to get it she back. wants her magic she like she's i'm nothing without it i think that's that's going to go an interesting path now especially that she's teamed up with whatever the dude's name is whatever they're not teamed up they're just well i mean riding a horse together they're they, they're going to be together for the next episode i bet i bet there they'll be a, a duo for the next episode um and how how they're going to feed off of each other and probably be like a like a love hate relationship they got to help each other out but they don't necessarily like each other kind of thing Geralt and Siri thing went kind of where I thought it was from episode two into episode three uh it kind of it kind of drove the way I thought it would which is uh, cool it's cool to s sometimes that narrative that you think's gonna happen sometimes happen the way you think it is I I uh I think that she's still I Geralt was kind of tapping into her powers and letting her know like, hey you do have these powers and i know you have these powers and i'm pretty sure you know he knows there's more he's good yeah he's gonna help unleash that power and control that power because he even said that her mom could had un uncontrolled power you know mm -hmm. i got nothing i just i just don't know there's just so much i'm just <sighs> at least this episode wasn't as confusing no it wasn't Pretty straightforward. Pretty straightforward episode, so. But I want to know why that centipede didn't just attack her. It just looked at her. Anyway, uh, thanks for coming by, and uh, we'll be back for uh, episode four on the next one. Until then, we are Motophoto. Y'all have a good one. Bye.